Hello and welcome back to Income Strategies, the place where you learn the skills to make money, to multiply your money and to manage your money. Today we're on another episode of Inter-Exchange Arbitrage on Gates.io. Yes, we're doing this for the very first time on this channel. Now, I do hope, fingers crossed, that Gate.io is going to perform because a lot of people have been rooting for this platform. That you test it out, that you try it out, that you do things with it. Okay, okay, okay. Now let's get started. <laughs> All right. So what do we have here? We've got Spirit slash USDT. So we're going to be doing this from gate.io to MEXC. So let's go see how this works, okay? Let's check all the parameters, let's check on the coin, let's see the differences, and then we can now go on and see what we need to do. Okay, so first off, we can see that the price is 0.00269, that's it. So what are we working with? We're working with 20 USDT as usual. So I'm just gonna put in 20 USDT here. Wow, let me, Click on this again just to be sure I'm seeing 10,000. Oh, no, no, that was wrong. 20. <laughs> 20 USDT, 7,434.94. Okay, now it's 270. Wow. Let's quickly copy this. All right. We are going to have to send our funds, you know, from Binance because I don't have any funds in gate.io. So I need to send my funds over. So let me quickly check this out in MEXC and see what we've got. All right. So I'm just going to check this and then see what we get and so i'll just click on sell and then put in the amount of spirit we have here and see we have 21.6 wow this is interesting so let's go check on the parameters and see how this is going to work out because i must let you know that if you're on gate.io you can't even check how much the withdrawal is. <laughs> the withdrawal amount, you can't get it because it's not going to allow you, right? So if I go to wallet here and I want to, okay, let me click on this. If I want to withdraw, it's not going to even allow me to try out to see what the withdrawal amount is because there's no coin here. So it says there's nothing. So even if I put spirit here, it's not going to allow me even check what the withdrawal fees are. So I'm just going to just rely on what I can, you know, gauge probably from um, using information from Mexi. I'm just going to use that. So I'm here on Mexi. If Just imagine I wanted to withdraw and I went to withdraw, you know, um, Spirit, which is on the Phantom Network. So let's say I want to withdraw Spirit. Um, you can see that it's on the FTM um, network. That's the only network that's available, right? So that's 10 spirit, 10 spirit, and 10 spirit on Mexi. I don't even know how much it is to withdraw in gate.io. I hope it's not going to be a big mistake, but I mean, one of my subscribers asked that we do this, so I'm willing to try this out. So let's go ahead and see. So, but first off, we need to transfer money you know that's um where we have funds are on binance so i don't have any funds on gate.io i have to let you know so i'm currently on xlm slash usdt and xlm is 0 0.0903 so i'm just gonna quickly you know get the hundred percent of that uh let me see let me do that again and get the hundred percent and then let's buy oh it's not picking up everything we're not getting everything mm. Okay, for the sake of this, I'm going to have to make this like $21 because I don't want it to go, I don't want it to go lower than 20. All right, so let me top up this, right? I'm going to top this up by just clicking transfer and I'm just going to put in just one, one USDT there. And the whole idea is because I don't want this to go lower than 20. I'm always using $20, right? But I don't want this to go lower than 20 so that we're sure that we don't have anything less. Okay, we can see that it's not picking up every single thing, okay? So at least whatever it picks, it's over $20, and that's the most important thing, okay? So let me do this. Let me refresh again, and then let's go. What we have here is 232, two, okay? And it's... Oh... It's like it's only picking up. Has this gone up again? I don't know the reason why this is lean. Let me do this one more time. 
let's go let's go to this and check it's supposed to pick up everything but if it's not picking up okay well two three two oh i don't know why this is like this i just oh 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 wow it's gone up that's the reason why okay it's gone up anyways we just have to buy okay so it has bought so now that we have bought it right what do we have we've got 232.21 so let's get that done first off we need to go over to gate.io and pick up the deposit address okay so we're picking up the deposit address as you click on deposit and then it says uh, unchain deposit or gate code no no unchain deposit so i want to um let's search for xlm you can search for xlm xlm all right that's stellar so it's the xlm network okay so i'm just gonna pick it up it has two things don't forget it has the the address it also has the memo right so those two things have to be taken so the first one is the address so let's quickly go over to Binance and then we quickly go to the wallet and withdraw okay so we're withdrawing now next up is that I'm just going to um, put in XLM all right so you can see we have 232.218 so I'm gonna click on that and then the, this is the address all right so put in the address Stellar network we need the memo all right so we're gonna go over to the memo don't forget that we need the memo all right so let's go to the memo all right let's put this here good so what do we have we're gonna pick up the max and you can see here that the withdrawal fee is 0 0.02 like I told you it's the cheapest way to move your funds around so let's go ahead and click on withdrawal good so everything looks set we just need I'm just gonna take that and then click on confirm so obviously I'm gonna have to do my verifications and then it will be off it will be off 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 all the way to gate.io world <laughs> okay so let's wait oh yeah so I'll be back after my verifications see you shortly Wow you can see that the XLM is already on its way and it has already gone so it says completed so let's go over to um, where we have our gate.io and then see whether it has arrived okay Let's go over and see whether it has arrived. I'm waiting. It says completed, but I haven't seen it here. Anyways, let's hope that this doesn't take so long. We are waiting. Okay, so it's showing me my spot account, my margin account. Everything you can see here is zero. So, well, I don't know. Until it arrives here, it says it hasn't showed up. So we're waiting. <laughs> All right, I'll be back once it completes. See you shortly. Okay, it has arrived like about after five minutes. <laughs> okay, it's here. So we have it here in our spot account and we need to quickly go over to see what we have. So I'm gonna just quickly change this to, you know, XLM, XLM USDT. So that should, it should have it there. All right, so it has available 232198, okay? So what we want to do is to sell. That's what we want to do, all right? So currently we have this, so let's click on sell. We need to sell this XLM because we need to get this into the trade as quickly as possible. So we just need to tap on one of these prices, either the one in the red or the one in the green. So we're going to probably lose some money. So if I take this 100%, Oh, yeah, it was initially 20.94 now. I mean, 96. Now it's 20.94. We're going to lose some part of the money, but that's fine. Let's just get this sold quickly so that we can get cracking. All right. So don't forget, we have a target to hit quickly. So let's click on sell. Let's see whether it will go. Okay. So where are we? It seems like we are in the queue. No, I don't want to be in the queue. Let's cancel that. 
and let's go back. So we're going to do this one more time. Uh, let's just pick on this and see. Oh, it's going lower. But we just got to have to get this sold. That's the first thing we need to do anyways. So let's get this sold quickly. And then let's click on this. And let's go. Let's see whether it got it sold. I think it did. Oh, are we in the queue? It looks like we're still in the queue. Come on. I don't want to be in the queue. So if that is the reason, we need to pick a lower price. Okay. Uh, we need to pick a lower price. Let's see whether we can get this sold for this lower price. Let's go with this lower price. And let's see. Let's hope it got sold. I don't know. I think it did. It did. Yeah. Wow. What happened? Oh, we're not, we're not able to get everything sold. <laughs> okay, so we got back. Oh, now I get it. We were not able to get everything sold, so... We need to make sure that we get every single thing sold. Let's see if we can get this sold. Let's see. Let's try and see whether this is going to get sold. So right now we've been able to sell this. And what we have is 20.87. Okay. That means that we've lost about 10 cents. Nine cents actually to be precise. So what we have here is 20.87. All right, so now we are just about to start this assignment. Okay, so let's go over to Spirit. Now let's hope, keep our fingers crossed that Spirit USDT is still the same price. If it isn't, that is, means we're going to call it a wrap. Okay, so what do we have here? Two eight seven oh my god it's gone up wow 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 so let's quickly see what this is going to give us okay so we've got 20.87 and we want to buy and let's see let's quickly do all the simulations quickly again and let's go over to mexi i do pray that we still have a good price there if not that's the end of this inter exchange arbitrage. <laughs> let's go ahead and see. Okay, let's hope that this works. Let's hope. Oh my God, it really has gone down. It has gone down. Okay. Well, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, 21.1. Okay, it's still good. It has gone down. It was supposed to be 21.6, but let's quickly go. Let's not waste time. So we're going back over to gate.io. So what we have here is that we're buying. But now let's take a good look at this. What do we have here? We have 20.85. Okay, 20, 0.0287. So now look at this. If we want to get this sold quickly, we will just have to buy. Let's just go ahead and do this, right? Let's hope this would allow us to move. Wow. Can it allow us to move quickly? Let's try and see. Okay. Let's just click on it and buy. Let's see if this will allow us to buy quickly. Oh, are we in the queue? Yes, we are. We are in the queue. We are now going to have to check to see whether we can actually get this sold. Okay. We've sold 14%. Oh, no. That means that we need to actually work on this, okay?